Oh my god! Um, I just shout out to the video team at HRC. Like, who is, is anyone here who's involved with editing the videos tonight? Please pass on to them that it's some of. The, I've been to a lot of galas, not to brag, um, but these are some of the best videos at galas I've ever seen. And I know that's a narrow awards category, but if there's a category for videos at galas, uh, send me a ballot. Um, I am so beyond honored to be here with people who I feel do. Uh, so much more important work than I do, who are uh, just working on the front lines of this cause, who are working in politics. Um, I have a, a, a bit of a history as an LGBTQ ally. I've come a long way tonight from my roots of um, my friend Tyler coming out to me via AOL Instant Messenger in high school and him saying, so I haven't told anyone this, but um, yeah, I'm gay. And me going, cool. Um, so what are you gonna sing for Chicago auditions? Because <laughs> that's what I really cared about. Um, or my friend Brendan coming out to me in a car and me saying, so this means we can't still hook up because I definitely had a type. Um, but on, on a more serious note, um, so I was really, really, uh, I'm really touched by everyone's speeches here tonight, but especially Jen's speech. Um, I, uh, there, uh, one of my closest family members is trans. He is eight years old, and he just got to a new school and for the first time said, hi, uh, I'm a boy. He's using the boys' bathroom, and it appears to be not a thing. <laughs> yeah, uh, he is one of the happiest kids I have ever met, um, also just did his first play, and <laughs> that's beside the point. And I just have to say, um, watching how much of not a thing it was, it's a tribute to the work done by everyone in this room. So I just add my name to the list of people whose lives and families who are affected directly by the work you're all doing. So thank you, just thank you. Um, so, I. I thrilled to get an award for being an ally because it feels effortless to me to be an ally to the LGBTQ community. Um, really all of the smartest, kindest, and funniest people I know happen to be in the LGBTQ community. Truly, I'm not blowing smoke up your ass. I, th this is true. I don't know why. Um, I think there might be something to uh, the idea when you're marginalized, you have a a zoomed out perspective on the world, perhaps. It's like those um, spam emails that Jewish grandmas send around um, about how uh, a, a disproportionate amount of Nobel Prize laureates are Jewish and we don't know why. And they're spam emails, yes, but I think there's something to that. Um, <laughs> but, but really, I, whenever I wanna write a, a character who, for lack of a better way of saying it, sees through everyone's shit and gets to the point, I automatically wanna make them in the LGBTQ community. That's just what I want. Um, so I would love to hear some theories about why that is. Um, come up to me at my table. I'm at table 14. Um, but uh, look, I'm, I'm gonna say something that, that is not groundbreaking in this room. Supporting LGBTQ rights is, it's, it's just supporting human rights. I mean, hence the name of this nonprofit. Um, it's, to me, it's just, uh, um, I don't know a poetic way to say no duh, <laughs> but no duh. Um, it, it, until we are all equal in the eyes of the law and the world, no one is truly equal. And I know I'm not the first person to say that, but I'm gonna say it with authority as if I am the first person to say it. Um, you know, America, I, I support LGBTQ rights because I'm a proud American. America, yeah, yeah, and I am, I am proud to be in this country, uh, America is, it was theoretically founded on the principle that everyone is created equal, and I'm gonna ignore the hypocrisy of that founding just for tonight, <laughs> to embrace the reason I'm here. Um, because that principle is, it's, it's why I'm proud to be here. I, I support LGBTQ rights because I, I am a proud American who supports all human rights. Um, and to, to support those rights is to support human rights, and I just, I can't think of anything more patriotic than that. So thank you. Thank you for giving me an award. Thank you for embracing me in your community. And um, look, I'm a, I'm a straight white cisgender woman. 
I'm an idiot. <laughs> I mean, I'm not an idiot, but like, tell me. Tell me what I can do. Tell us all what we can do, how we can help. I am at your disposal. I am here. Every time I hear a story, it enlightens me more. So just um, don't be afraid to educate me because I'm learning new things every day. So please come up to my table 14 and fucking educate me. Tell me things that I don't know, <laughs> please. Um, so thank you for constantly teaching me. Thank you for teaching me tonight. Thank you to all the lessons I'm about to learn tonight at table 14. And thank you for this award. Thank you so much.